Centuries ago, oceans were an open space where freedom was the rule. They are now a collective domain, immense but delicate, and needing a united global approach to administration and security. Collaboration of maritime surveillance technologies between international authorities is critical for immediate resolution of the global crisis, which affects our oceans today. I do not limit the sector to oceans alone, but also include seas, water bodies, and freshwater systems. It is imperative that maritime surveillance technologies are focused on these six core areas, being critical to flora, fauna, and humankind alike. First, sovereignty, territorial integrity, and political independence. Sanctity of sea lines of communications. Safety from maritime crimes. Access to maritime resources and to seabed. Environmental protection. Security of all seafarers. The vast gamut of maritime surveillance technologies, ranging from satellite based sensors to long-range land-based systems and underwater sensors are too many to cover in the space of this talk. Most maritime nations are deploying surveillance technology to, fo to focus on seven main sectors. Maritime safety for seafarers, maritime security in EEZs, prevention of pollution produced by ships, control of fisheries, marine pollution preparedness and response, marine environment protection, and customs border control, general law enforcement and defense. Data is collected from multiple types of sensors, including radio, radar, underwater sensors, satellite images, etc. The multitude of varied international bodies handling vast magnitudes of surveillance information through uncoordinated policies, coupled with the proliferation of security threats at sea, and the constraints imposed by the economic recession have fueled the desire to assist exchange of maritime surveillance information between authorities. Thereby resides the need for development of an integrated approach to universal maritime surveillance. In principle, a voluntary concerted platform that enables member states to coordinate their response, streamline their resources and share knowledge to avoid fragmentation of information and duplication of efforts and costs is the need of the hour. I will briefly focus on space-based technologies to help canvas the support that our oceans need. Oceans without borders is a common theme across nations today and space as the final frontier offers unrestricted access to monitor and protect this vital resource. 